Um, I arrived late for Isha during Ramadan. So I prayed Isha alone. By the time I finish, they have already started Taraweh. I needed to pray sooner after Isha. So was I right to pray the sooner after Isha or I skip it and pray Taraweh? Okay, got your question, Sister Saliha from Kenya. Whenever somebody comes to the masjid late on any of the nights of Ramadan, which means there will be a taraweeh after the congregation Elisha prayer and sunnah, don't pray by yourself. Wait until the Imam begins the first couple rakahs of taraweeh and join, but with the intention of praying Asha. Sheikh, but the Imam will only pray two rakahs, and he just mentioned the night prayer two by two. I know. So is it permissible to pray fard prayers with the intention of praying fard behind an imam who is praying voluntary prayer? Yes, it is permissible, guaranteed. And that happened during the life of the Prophet Sallallahu When one of the companions arrived late and he missed the congregational prayer. So the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, who would like to give sadaqah to your brother? Meaning, you can go ahead, stand up to pray. Pray your own sunnah. And he will join you with the intention of praying his mandatory prayer. So this way, it will become a jama'ah for him and a charity from you upon him. Then, with regards to the surakas or the sunnah of Asia prayer, they are very important. They are emphatic rakas. You may... Pray them while the Imam is still leading the Taraweeh, no problem. And you may wait until the Imam wraps up his Taraweeh, then you pray the two Sunnah. You make it up after Taraweeh, all of that is permissible. You still have plenty of time till Fajr, though. 